So, what a fantastic year 2017 has been. TSC's made history. We've got the only woman ever to win a car for clay shooting. And she was 13 years old. Will Weaver, one of the original Academy members, wins his car. He's tried that for three or four years. He tried it when Tom Scott won his car. What a great ending to a fab year. TSC is brought to you with support from Sabanti Guns from Range Ride, CCI Clays, Yield Its Guns, Ely Cartridges, Browning Guns, Bowman Traps, Breeden School, and Charles Stanley Wealth Management. The Academy, one of the most successful years we've had in the Academy. Charlie Madden, one of the top scoring people in the school's challenge throughout the year. Okay, he didn't win the car, but he never dropped below 44 all year. He shot some great CPSA scores. Tom Howe, one of the top shooting instructors we've ever had at the Oxford Gun Company. Tom and I have worked really hard to get the academy to one of the best academies in the UK. Sabati February Championships. Saw Dimitri, Russian customer, win his first gun. Breeden, one of the top schools in the UK for shooting. What a fab year it has been for them. The Oxford Gun Company family, what a great result. Doug and Shirley started Oxford Gun Company some 37 years ago. They've been in the business 45 years. What a great milestone. The Oxford Gun Company had its busiest year. Lots of people buying guns, lots of people trying shooting for the first time. We've now had over 20,000 people try our have a goes. The Browning August, what great competition it was. The festival of shooting in September. We had the most people we've ever had through the gates. And we've had the most people ever tried shooting. We've got our first air gun shoot, air gun range. The sport as a whole, the CPSA, got their most members they've ever had. They had the biggest entry on some of their championships. Basque, their milestone, 150,000 members. If that's not an achievement, what is? Thanks to Yieldits, they brought out a fantastic value for money starter gun, under 800 pounds. Because not everyone can afford a Maruku, Browning, Beretta, Prazi. Not everyone wants to be a competitive shot. Some people just want to buy a cheap gun, five, six, seven hundred pounds, and just go out, have a couple of lessons, then go out on a Sunday morning, shoot in a local gun club, shoot 50 sporting, and then go down to the pub at lunchtime. It's not got to be competitive, competitive, competitive. It's not got to be win, win, win with shooting. It's all about enjoying it. It's all about going out. Fantastic countryside. Some of the fun, nicest places you'll see host some of the big good shoots, some of the good game shooting. A really, really, really great way to entertain your friends. If you've got friends that have never shot before, say to them, why don't you come up and have a lesson or come and have a, have a go? Just come and have a bit of an enjoyment. You've probably seen throughout the year on TSC TV, just some people, whether you're old, whether you're young, whether you're female, male, they've all enjoyed it. They've all had a great, a great time clay shooting. In the TSC, okay, we've, we've put through nearly a thousand kids through that TSC. The go. Novice Schools Challenge brought in 60 new kids. Okay. So a little bit. But have you seen all those go into it? Okay, you've seen some of the new people going into it in the Winter Series. But there's also some people that's gone through there that don't want to go into the Schools Challenge. They just want to have a bit of fun. They want to enjoy it. They want to go out with their friends. They want to shoot a few clays. Enjoy it. The brand new cafe that we've got at the Oxford Gun Company. It's all there to make people enjoy shooting, to make people have fun. That's what it's about. That's what life, that's what shooting is all about. 
little, little Christmas fun competition. Over Christmas and New Year, if you're out shooting, either game shooting, clay shooting, whatever, with your family, with your friends, send us a picture. Send it to charlotte at the Oxford Gun Company .co.uk and there'll be a prize for the best picture, best Christmas and New Year shooting picture and that prize will be announced in January. So get photos, get your iPhone out, even if it's a little film, make yourself a little film and send it to charlotte at oxfordguncompany.co.uk. Good luck, let's see what happens. So, 2018. What will happen in 2018 for shooting? Will the BBC push it anymore? Let's hope. Let's get everyone on the BBC's back. Let's get the BBC pushing shooting. Whether it's game shooting, clay shooting. Let's see if we can get Countryfile to do a full films, lots of films, on shooting. Let's get it out there. Let's get the average Joe blogs seeing what shooting is all about. Okay, you might hear all over the news, you might hear all over the telly. We've got Brexit coming. What's going to happen in 2018? Times are hard. Okay, some people might be spending less money, but at least we've got more people shooting, more people coming into it. Even whether they buy guns or not, at least they're having a go at shooting. At least they're trying it. We've got a brand new The Wing Shooting Show in London. Now, they are so keen on promoting fishing, shooting. They've even, they've invested heavily. They did their first one last year. The Wing Shooting Show on the 23rd and 24th of March in London. Let's get all your friends. Let's go there. Let's support them. They really are trying to get more people into shooting and fishing. It's in London. It's bringing, it's bringing the, the country into the city. It's getting those country people into the city. It's telling them, it's educating them. That's what we need to do. That's the biggest thing we need to do, educate them. Basque, they've got loads of new inventions on next year. Let's see if they can reach 200,000 members. CPSA, let's see if they can double their membership. Let's get more people into shooting into the countryside. That's what we've got to do. That's what the sport's got to pull together. So whether it is, whether Brexit is a good thing, whether times are hard, this is the time for the whole sport to pull together and get out there and show people what the sport can do. So, thanks for watching us in 2017. Keep tuned into the Facebook pages, keep tuned into TSC TV. The, the TSC kicks off again in March. Don't forget, We'll be back in January. See you there.